Hello, my name is Gabe to the Max, and I am going to show you a tutorial how to use Windows Live Movie Maker. This is my first tutorial, so this is going to be very bad, but yeah, okay, let's go. The tutorial of uh, the basics. First, you want to do is, of course, add a clip. Now, on the home tab, what you can do is add some music. Just click on add music and get, uh, pick your music out. Here, I use this one. Uh, only use uncopyrighted music or it will get sent off from YouTube. But, webcam video, you can record your webcam videos, of course. If you want to record your own voice, click record narration, snapshot, it takes a picture from the clip, like this. New snapshot, it will save and you get the snapshot here. Uh, yeah, if you want to make an intro, just click on title and make your intro here. So you can choose how long you want to be the text, and if you want to choose how long to be the black screen, just to, uh, yeah, wait. Oh, yeah, video tool, and you do this four or something. And it's four seconds the text and four seconds the black screen. So this is just an intro. But of course, oh, sorry, no, never mind. Now home again. But if you want to make a nicer intro, you can just click on here or this one. Oh, no, sorry. This one, it makes a nice transition like that. I like uh, this one very much. So, yeah, you can do this. So, yeah, you could choose whatever you want. Uh, let's choose this one. Oh. Uh, it makes your own uh, outro, but you don't need that. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, yes. So you can rotate left. I don't know what that does. Okay, it makes the video go rotate left, you know, yeah. Rotate right. I go come back to here later. Oh, no, if you just want to uplo upload something, just click on YouTube. And do not click on these ones. Do not yet click it. Just go to video tool of a uh, wait. Just go to project and click on white screen. I totally forgot forget that on my own videos. Very stupid, but yeah, project white screen and then click on here and then click on this one or this one. It makes it full screen on YouTube. So um, yeah, you can make credits like this, like this. Uh, yeah, let's make a nice transition, nice and easy, uh, either. So, yeah. Animation. You can make your nice uh, transition to it. You can just click on this one here. And you can make something, you can get something like uh, this. And then you get this. So it's very cool. Uh, I don't use it for intros, but I didn't use it for sh when it, they shoot. But I can show you later on all the clips. If you want to zoom, just click on here, and you can choose to zoom, like this. You can see it goes slowly, slowly. You cannot, uh, yeah, exactly choose where you want to zoom in, but yeah, it's when the movie maker. But okay, what next? Visual effects. Here, you can choose the visual effects on the clip. Uh, you can do this one, that's very nice, this, but if you want more, just click on here, and yeah, choose whatever you want, let's do, yeah, fade out to black, you need, it's very uh, nice to do, fade out to black, everybody use it, then look at the end, it fades out, with black, it's nice for the outro to go to the black screen, now, oh, you can use, you know, you can change the brightness, see, Makes it a little nicer, or you can just do this one. But yeah, it's not really uh, necessary. Now to project, what you can do audio mix. You can make the sound louder of the music, or the uh, the video like this. You only hear the hear the video. If you do this, you only hear the music, of course. But if you do a little like this. You can uh, still hear the, sh the the shot, I think. Yeah, you can still hear the shot. I didn't do that in my uh, mini uh, I f I don't know why, but okay. And face video. If you just you can do just click on here. The sound of your voice gets louder than everything else 
video music and if you just don't want that just click on here and it's normal again set to music it doesn't work okay widescreen yes okay view you can zoom in not zoom in in the video but you can zoom in how yeah how to edit here thumbnail size yeah, I can uh, do this. So whatever you like, waveforms, you can uh, hear the music, it's very uh, nice to do. So, video tools. Now the video tools are very important. The split is very important, but let's start here. Yeah? Video volume, you can just change the video volume with everything here. Fade in, you can uh, fast the volume of the video. It goes, it fades in very slow, you know. Like uh, yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> you can change, the, you can change the speed of the video like this. But if you don't want to go like 1.5, not 1.25, or 1.30 or something, just do this. Oh, what? Hey. Oh, oh no, no, one comma three. Okay. And uh, yeah, it goes like this, a little faster, eh? Nice. Split. This is very important to edit your videos. It's really nice to do. If you do split, look. On the shoot, uh, when he shoots, split. Now you can change the ad the visual effects and animations on this clip on here. You can just do uh, I don't know. I I don't know visual effects. I go. Fade in from white, and it go just goes like this. But uh, I forgot to do, the, and then you just do fade out to black hair away. But now that you have a a white thing when you shoot, it's really nice. I don't use it very much often because uh, everybody knows it. But okay, trim tool. I uh I never I never use this. I really I never use streams and so set start point. You can set the start point of your video. Just uh, like set start point here, end point here. Now it starts earlier, but you miss a frame here. So you can do that. Video stabilization. It's only good when you're really filming with your camera. So when you do this, anti shake, it's loading right here. And it goes like shaky, shaky, because you are shaking with the view. But yeah, you cannot, you can only do it in everything or not. So just don't use it if you don't like it. Music tools. You can fade in with the music. Hear it? It goes very slow. Here? Yeah. Or you can uh, fade out very slow. Which you can also do just not. And it starts just. What you can do, you can split it as well. Go to the music. And do, just do this. Or and this. I don't know what you like. Uh, and you can just do uh, something. Uh, yeah, great editors can do something great with it. Uh, you know, text tool. Now you can change the text here. So, uh, yeah, those are the basics. But if you want uh, to start the music on the sh on the shoot, on the sh shooting that you are making, yeah, it's really stupid on music uh, yeah, on this program. But just go to music tool, set start point here somewhere, and then you just have to, yeah. That was on the music. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? Ah, never mind. I will uh, do that in the next part. So, this is not meant to be nice, but I'm just showing the basics here. Yeah, that is all. I do credits. So, yeah, leave in the comments below. What you what tutorial you want me to show you, like uh, how to edit a music or how to do cool transitions or something like that. So yeah, just comment, please like and subscribe, and become a gamer to the max. Yeah, bye.